Okay, this new scripts are finally here, and I appreciate all you guys for waiting. It's been a minute, not gonna lie, but we're about to hit 3k. Uh, just make sure you subscribe, like, and put them notice on so you know you hear first when there's an update. I got you for sure. Alright, and if you guys could do me a favor, follow, you know, wifey stream. You catch me in there all the time, 24-7. But if you do need to get a hold of me or contact me about anything, this is my Instagram. Same as my YouTube. Crokes, this is my profile. Just sh shoot me a DM. And I'll try to get with you, alright? But first things first, let's get straight into this. Um, you're going to want to go to, I'm going to leave all the links in the description, don't worry. Alright, but you want to go to chronismax.com. You want to make sure you get the, you know, most updated, because you need the, your studio and your kind of seem to be updated for the new scripts. The first thing, if you're, um, if you're Apple or you got the Max, you want to click this one, but for most people, you're going to want to get Zen Studio. Just download that. I'll put that on the desktop right here. Once that's done, I'm going to open it. Alright. Close out of that real quick. But then you want to download um, the uh, Cronus Updater. You want to click on it after it's done downloading. Alright, for this part, you're going to want to, so, a lot of people have problems with this. So, on the, so, if you lay your Kronos flat, right, you flip it over, there's going to be a tiny blue button on the back. So, you want to unplug your Kronos if it's plugged in, alright, and then, the blue button the blue button on the back you're gonna want to hold it down while you're holding it plug your Kronos into your PC and then it should make that noise should pop up on the Kronos it should say Zen bootloader I'm gonna click on it I'm gonna uncheck this box right here I'm gonna go to the very top beta 50 that's what I'm on right now begin update so it's going to take a second for it to update it's pretty fast alright and after this gets done you can close out of this and you probably yeah, I'll say close out of that, or just minimize it, whatever, it's cool. So, <clears throat> in Discord, these are Verita scripts. So, if you want just the scripts, you have to set them up by yourself. Like, they all come, like, blank. You're going to want to, you're going to want to, um, download these. But, if you want, my scripts I'm gonna put the in my discord alright <laughs> in this discord right here there's gonna be a, a croaks channel right here I'm gonna put everything you need in this channel so you wanna join this discord I'm gonna put both of the discords in the description you can join both of them but my scripts my edited scripts will be in this discord right here in this channel croaks channel so just join it Say what's up in chat, do whatever you feel me. And then after that, you download the scripts. I have them right here. You're gonna want to go to um, Zen Studio. It's gonna say connect your Zen. You're gonna wanna grab that blue cord that goes into the right side of it. You're gonna want to plug it in real quick. 
want to make sure it's all the way plugged in. Just gotta make the noise. Everything's gonna pop up. Everything's gonna be good. Then you want to go to your device. Make sure that the 16-bit compiler is not checked. Everything I have on the screen right here, besides the PlayStation, because you might be Xbox. Everything this is, or actually, you don't need this remote play right here. I use that because I use remote play. But other than that, everything here checked. Make sure you know it's all looking similar. You want to go to compiler. Once you got the, once you got the um, the scripts, you just drag them in. Should just copy right in like this. Then you want to hit compile. If nothing happens, that means it's good to go. Alright, after that, after you got both of them, those should, both should be good. But I need to go to the attacker one real quick. And I'm just going to edit this, so it's already going to be edited in, the, in uh, the Discord that I'm in. Let me just edit this real quick. You don't have to. And you could go along and do it yourself if you would like. But um, you you do not have to do this. You can watch me do it. Um So after you're done with that, I'm going to go to programming. See, these are the old scripts. You just want to delete them. I'll go right here to these little lines, the scripts. I always put my attacker one first and my defender one second. After that, you want to click this little play button. Hit save. It's going to save your, to your Cronus. Then after that, you're going to want to open... Um, you want to... Load up Rainbow Six Siege, and I'm gonna do that right now. Alright, so once you get into Rainbow Six, or Siege, whatever, you're on the script, right? First thing you're gonna wanna do, because a lot of people have been having um, issues with the controller, the recoil going up, or this and that, having trouble with sticky aim. So, I'm gonna break it down for you real quick. So first, VM speed, um, I have mine set to default, I was running it on PS4, PS5, but I'm just going to keep it at default. After that, you're going to go to mods, and if you want to get to, um, alright, I'll just take a second. So when you get to mods, you see this is your sensitivity. You don't have to use my sensitivity though. But if you do, you're going to set to this and that, make sure it's all good. You guys you guys have been having problems with the sticky aim or it's hard to when you aim, when you shoot, it gets hard to aim. I kind of fixed that to a certain degree. It's still a little sticky, but I fixed it. I I mean, I reduced the stickiness. So you're dead down 23. It should already be on the edited script in my Discord. But so let's just say you don't want to use my sensitivity. Um, make sure that 
you put your sensitivity right here. Sure. Make sure this is 23. And if you don't want your if you want your recoil to be good, set your um, Veritas AR to number two. And um, I say this all the time. Uh, these scripts, Veritas makes them, and I and I um, put my settings in them, and I edit them, and I give them to you guys. But in Discord, I'll have the the edited script for con like the controller. And I'll have my Zim, my um, Zim and Cronus scripts, and I'm gonna make um, another video on M and K on Cronus. But all right, so once you get to this part, you want to put the Vritas AR2. It's gonna make sure your recoil is good and everything. And so let's yeah, just say after you put in all my settings, you have my recoil, you just go to plug and play. Like that's pretty good right there and you guys are always like oh how do you crouch so fast so what we're going to do is go to how do you teabag so fast you know so you want to go over to mods teabag mine's on one and look how fast i got that's pretty fast i think that's like as fast as you can get it so after you do that but let's just say because a lot of people be like you know, my sensitivity is not working on my scripts. And it just all depends. It just depends on, the, you know, the situation or the scenario that you're in. So, let's just say my scripts, like, you're having trouble with my scripts. So, after, um, after you get the scripts, you want to make sure you, um, it's on Veritas AR2. You put your, you put your settings right here and 23 dead zone you got to do this for both scripts after you do that say you go to twitch just say you got recall but i don't i was pushing it i was like pushing it just say oh whatever you got scripts you just go right here to the um anti-recall click it oh mine says 43 40 negative 3. oh all right but say oh you guys and you just sit here so the higher the number on the vertical and the vertical is the left side so the higher the number the more it's going to pull down etc let's say oh my gun's pulling too much to the left. oh see i just fixed it I just, I just made it better so you went from this to this yeah a little bit better now you just do that My place is good, but it's the same. Whatever. It goes, if it goes to the left, pull it to the right. If it goes to the right, pull it to the left. And let's just say, oh, like I did it one to the left, and it didn't, and then and then it's too much. But once I do it one to the right, it still needs to go left. Like if you're having trouble with that, uh, for Twitch, she doesn't really have much attachments. But you could be like, oh, well, say it's not working out. You can just try a hollow or a 1.0 scope or you put on a flash hider or suppressor or muzzle or none you just gotta test out just keep trying with different attachments and then you know you recoil and I saw my recoil is so good because I sat here tested it well, I don't even play controller I just made this controller script for you guys I hope you guys, you know, you guys enjoy it I'm gonna make a video on the keyboard and mouse um, thing. Uh, MK on Cronus. But, um, that, you can also put, there's a lot of different mods that I don't use. Let's just like, a pan up, ping on shoot, or ping on shot. Inverted, crouch delay, yeah, crouch delay off, crouch spam off, you could literally turn on all these, right, but, f all right, for me, a perfect grenade is like 38,000, and you just like look up at the ceiling, and just hold it down, you'll be good, other than that, 
Um, no, that's, like the script is like you know it's pretty simple. It's pretty simple. But if you guys are um, I'll keep putting all my settings. If you don't want to use my setting, that's fine. Make sure you use Veritas AR2. Use that zone. And you know, you guys will have no recoil. And you know, I think I'm wrap it up because it's pretty simple. Nothing much to it. Um, if you guys need help, you know, I'll help you guys out. But for the most part, if you just follow the instructions, you watch the video. If you made it this far, I appreciate you for us. If you guys still can't get the recoil down, probably hop into a game with you or hop on you know try to help you out other than that hope you guys have a good day and i think that's where i'm gonna wrap it up and you know appreciate you guys